Hi, this is Pumika, and in this lesson, we are going to discuss some uh, some tips and tricks that you can include in your daily schedule in order to improve the language. Now, <laughs> I have written everyday hard work because whenever you learn a new skill, you have to work very hard in order to um, chisel it to perfection. जब हम स्विमिंग सीखते हैं तो हमको उसके अगले दिन खुद से प्रैक्टिस करना होता है एवरी डे द कोच विल नॉट कम एंड आस्क अस टू डू स्ट्रोक्स ओके दे विल आस्क यू टू प्रैक्टिस ऑन योर ओन सो दैट्स व्हाट आई एम गोइंग टू डू आई विल गिव यू सम टिप्स इन विच यू कैन परफेक्ट योर लैंग्वेज इन ऑर्डर टू राइट परफेक्ट रिप्लाईज और आंसर्स और एनी फॉर दैट मैटर एंड स्पीक एज वेल सो लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड पॉसिबल चेंजेस इन द डेली स्केड्यूल टू हेल्प इम्प्रूव द language now be practical i don't ask you to learn 50 pages of the dictionary in one day so you should only prepare for those goals which you personally think you'll be able to accomplish so be practical and then do not cram also jab hum koi cheez rakhte hain i think wo cheez kabhi samajh mein nahi aati never in your life so whenever uh, you feel that there's a new word and you're not able to understand it open up the dictionary if you think aapko uh, english mein bhi meaning samajh mein nahi aayega to aap english to hindi dictionary bhi le sakte hain jisme jo meaning hai wo hindi mein diya hua hota hai so most of the times when you remember the meaning in hindi you'll remember the word also so don't cram and use these kind of techniques to learn use the newer words wisely <laughs> now uh, there was this time when i used to learn new words when i was in school i would use wrong words instead of wrong places you know so that was pretty funny because uh, my friends would never be able to make out because you know long words but my teachers will be able to do that and they laugh at me and not like not in a negative way but they'll 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 tell me politely of course but then they'll all also laugh so don't be like me whenever you have a new word try to understand the meaning uh through the dictionary of course as i said and use it wisely if you don't know the meaning don't use it learn 10 new words every week and incorporate it into your speaking now this thing uh, we used to do it at school and um, the teacher the english teacher she used to check also and she used to sign that page so these tips they have helped me greatly read a magazine and find out the meaning of the words immediately there and then now i recommend you a number of current affairs magazine i would uh, i would recommend you the chronicle i think the chronicle is really very good because it has a uh, topic wise paragraphs and topic wise essays so if you if you read um, um an essay on science and technology then you will you'll know what to expect from it and you will know how to write similar articles and then if you get stuck on a word if you don't understand the meaning don't go forward with it there and then open up your dictionary and try to understand in this way you you you'll gain knowledge by understanding the text better also write short articles using the magic elements now let's talk about the magic elements quotes or phrases as i already told you they they try to attract interest of the reader better words again by having a good vocabulary good grammar by practicing from a good grammar book as i told you and meaningful paragraphs i remember i was doing the certificate course from stanford university and uh, i think it was on human rights yes so whatever activity we were assigned to do whatever um, assignment we were asked to submit the question used to stay write four to five meaningful paragraphs so when they say meaningful you know you're not supposed to write anything and everything your paragraphs your essays they should have a good content they should be very uh, reader friendly they should be very readable very understandable and meaningful as well just anything and everything kuch bhi likh diya kaat diya ghas kaat diya aisa nahi chalega do not be shy in taking part in public speaking contests now this i am saying it don't confine yourself into a comfort zone and stay in it try to come out of your comfort zone and your comfort zone will i i must say it will it will enhance it will get bigger so if you get comfortable at stage while speaking that's the best part you will know that you've accomplished this course very very nicely failure is the road to success of course i've used a quote here so i would like to wish you all the best i have tried my best to make this video short 
so that you can watch this quickly and then get perfect in the language that you want to get perfect in thank you so much for watching if you have any queries you can uh, write down in the comment section as i keep saying in every video please follow me uh, rate this course and recommend this to all your friends who are trying to improve their english thank you for watching